It happened. It happened. Ah, 26 years old and I've been to my first ice hockey game. <laughs> So yeah, 26 years old, first hockey game. Check that off my list of the things I do in Sweden. If you guys haven't uh, been watching my videos, um, I am uh, an English person, you can probably tell by my voice, and uh, I moved to Sweden last year. So um, I just wanted to really document and really uh, show people my experiences of an outsider coming to Sweden um, and, and experiencing Swedish culture. I'm trying. I'm trying everything I can to to really understand uh, what Swedish people like, what they don't like, what they are exposed to, what they like. Um, yeah, just what they class as normal. Because even though a lot of people say Sweden and England are both very similar countries, which they are in many ways, they're both very different countries in many ways. So. Ice hockey is a big thing in Sweden. I'm, I'm a big sports fan. When I say a sports fan, I mean football. <laughs> I'm a football fan. I'm, uh, yeah, so I've grown up loving football, supporting Liverpool. Yeah, that's controversial. It's not said that. And uh, wanting to be a footballer uh, growing up. So football, I was obsessed with football growing up and it was just like my life. Um, here in Sweden, football is... Bigger, I think. I think football is bigger than ice hockey, but ice hockey is still a very big sport. And I guess there's a lot of people here that grow up want to be an ice hockey player. Um, so my experience is growing up wanting to be a footballer. A lot of Swedish kids have grown up wanting to be an ice hockey player. So I just wanted to really uh, show you guys and talk about my experience of my first hockey game. Uh, I've been to many football games growing up. Um, Hockey and football is not the same experience. It's not the same experience. Football, okay, bigger crowds, but it's outside. Football is not really an event. It's just a game. To me, I go to a football match, watch the game, go home. That is it. There's nothing really. When it's half time, okay, what do I do? Do I um, go and grab a drink? Do I go and grab some food? What do I do? I don't want to stand outside in the freezing cold for 15 minutes when nothing's happened, waiting to see the second half of a football game. Went to my first hockey match. It was great. It was great. It was uh, hockey. Hockey was the way. I, I, I'm assuming that the, the most hockey games are the same as the one I just saw. But it, it was like an event. They had lots of music, fire, not fireworks, but fire, and um, yeah, and other lighting and stuff. Just a lot of things going on and it was such a great experience. I enjoyed it even when there wasn't hockey being played. Um, it was really fun because it's indoors as well. Even though it's a smaller crowd, it feels a lot more intense and livelier. <laughs> So, livelier, lively is that even a word? So anyway, so yeah, it was kind of, I really enjoyed that atmosphere a lot. I, I, I can see myself going to more and more hockey games in the future. Um, the game I went to see was Rögle, um, in Engelholm, just 45 minutes down from here. They're in SHL. I don't know... Um, how big the SHL is, Swedish Hockey League is, uh, I'm assuming it's not as big as the NHL. I, I think that's the biggest hockey league in, in the world. SHL, I've been told, is one of the biggest in Europe. Maybe Russia's bigger, I don't know. Um, don't take my word for that. It's just my thoughts. I don't know too much about hockey. Uh, but I can see myself going to more games. And when I talk about the issue of waiting around for 15 minutes to see a second half of a football game, Every time hockey had a break, when there's two breaks, because there's three periods in hockey, they had they stuff going on. I mean, they had like a, a nine-year-old team playing for ten minutes in the middle of on on an ice rink on the on the ice. In between, it was, it was fun to watch the little kids try and play hockey and learn and 
And then in the other period, I, uh, during the break, I, I I can't remember what happened, but there was uh, there was music and there was st- always stuff going on. So it was it was a great it was a great thing. And I guess when you most people go to watch hockey, but you get a real event going on. So I just really wanted to share my experience of hockey with you because I really enjoyed it, and I can see myself going to more. If you're in Sweden or in a in a country where hockey is kind of a big deal and you haven't been to a hockey game, go, just do it. I really, I really enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I'm probably uh, turning into a hockey fan now. So uh, thank you guys for watching the video. Just, just a quick update of my experiences of a Brit living in Sweden. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment below if you have enjoyed it. Let me know what you liked, what you didn't like. Because I'm always looking to make better video, make better content for you guys. And uh, please like this video if you liked it. Please like this video if you didn't like it. Just share the love. I really appreciate it. And subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. And I hope you do. If you don't, please tell me why. Because, you know, feedback is good. Uh, Until next time, have a great day.